all month long, we have been shining a spotlight on history makers with ties to the University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff. Joining us now is Vice Chancellor Dr. Moses Goldman to tell us more about artist Kevin Cole. I, like I saw some of his artwork and this is amazing. It is amazing yes. and so is Kevin. Um, in fact, Kevin is an internationally renowned artist, mm -hmm. um, just a, a great guy. Uh, he's from Pine Bluff, grew up in Pine Bluff, graduated from Pine Bluff High School, the University of Arkansas at Pine Bluff, mm -hmm. earned two master's degrees, a Master of Fine Arts at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign, uh, okay. mm -hmm. and then uh, a second master's at the University of Northern Illinois. Mm -hmm. Uh, for over 30 years, Kevin's work has uh, depicted uh, the challenges, the struggles, the triumphs of the African-American experience uh, and has just done uh, a number of great things. Uh, his artwork is featured in over 4,000 venues around the country and internationally, galleries, museums, uh, and so forth. One of his most uh, prolific collections uh, centers around neckties. Okay. Uh, and Kevin, uh, he, he credits his grandfather for that inspiration. Uh, his grandfather talked to him a lot uh, throughout his years about the challenges of the African-American experience, the commitments that people made to freedom and prosperity. And when he was 18 years old, his grandfather took him out to a tree where uh, African-Americans had been uh, hung, actually, by their neckties wow. on their way to vote. Oh, and wow. that just had a deep, deep impact on Kevin. And so that's mm -hmm. the inspiration behind the necktie collection. Wow. But he, he says it also helped him to understand how important his vote is, mm -hmm. uh, not just personally, uh, but, to, but to continue the legacy. Yeah. I mentioned the over 4,000 venues yeah. where he has his work. Uh, the um, Smithsonian Museum for African American right. Culture mm -hmm. uh, in Washington, D.C., uh, our own Clinton Library, Yale University, uh, the Georgia Fine Arts uh, Museum, yeah. ju just to name a few. There was also the Olympics uh, the, site, too, right? Exactly. That was pretty he, cool. He painted the mural for the 1996 Olympics wow. in Centennial Park in, yeah. in Atlanta. Yeah, that's, that's, cool. that's really, really cool. Yeah. Uh, and Kevin will be speaking in town uh, oh, really? tomorrow when is, night. Tomorrow, okay. Yeah, the, uh, Afri uh, the, I'm sorry, the Arkansas. Uh, Fine Arts Museum. He will be the uh, featured speaker uh, for the Distinguished Laureate Lecture Series for the Arkansas Black Hall of Fame. Okay. 6 p.m. Unfortunately, tickets are sold out. Ah, uh, it, it was free and open to the public, yeah. uh, <laughs> but tickets are sold out. Fortunately, I was able to get Good. a couple of tickets, so uh, and I know then. Kevin, so I'll have a chance to reconnect with him uh, and really hear him talk about yeah. his work. And we certainly That's thank amazing. you all for the opportunity yeah. every week to just highlight uh, these history makers yeah, that's affiliated it. with UAP. We definitely enjoyed it. Next Next week will be our final one, right? That's correct. All right. Well, we look forward to that next week then. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. All right we will be right back.